I'm in the port of John Pop. Oh. Somebody's in there too. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Well, we're here. Man, that sun's bright today. He can get around me. He can go that way. Hey, it ain't my fault they put a dumpster there. Yeah, we'll pull it. We'll head it on. We're going to get this thing loaded up. Did you put a battery in it? Did you put a battery in it? No, I just dumped it off. Yeah. I told... What's up, bro? Pretty good. I told uh, Will if this guy's want you guys to get over there, Jeremy would dump it off. If not, call me. Then Will will take care of it. Okay? All right. 10-4, All right. buddy. Oh. We got to go by Lake Dell and get the root rate. You got a key? Yeah. Right. I'm going to switch my keys out while I'm here. You leaving? You in a hurry? You ain't going to visit? No. Uh, I mean, we got donuts and coffee in the truck. I don't have that guy. <laughs> Peanuts. <laughs> Pops, how you doing? What's Good wrong buddy? with skid steer? The door won't open now. I yeah, just I delivered it. Right. I know, that's what I told Tommy. I said, I went by there yesterday and crooked it up. Door over up fine. Chris got it to you guys, so the door open fine. You tell him to unlock it. That's what I told him. It's not <laughs> Action packed, that sounds like for him. <laughs> What's that? So you guys don't have no train horns. If you do the inside, just outside. Go ahead, climb up there. No, I've got train horns on the way. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I need to find my gloves and get to work. I was headed over to get on the loader. I've never seen that happen before me. <laughs> I know he runs them because he does this on his own sometimes, but I've never witnessed it myself. <laughs> Pop! Right here, your brake. Gotta slam it down. I think he's ready to be a YouTuber. Actually, I have seen him load one before. I think it was a. Uh, uh, can't remember what it was. This way a little bit, a little bit more. Let me check the back. Yeah, we're good. You all the way down? Roll it forward. All the way. Roll it. Roll down. There you go. Perfect. Nah, they'll jump it if it if it dies. I don't want to leave it running. be worked a little bit but it'll go where's the key switch this thing's got to get a bath We 
got this old Komatsu loaded up. One of my favorite machines of this contractor just because it's an old school open cab, <clears throat> old loader. I like it. I like it a lot. It uh, runs good. And uh, old school motor. Like I said, open cab. You can see your tires. You can see what you're doing. Just makes it a lot. A lot easier. I know in the summertime, obviously that is these nice. But uh, I like that old loader there. We're gonna go deliver it. All right, well, we're here. I don't see the rake yet. We're gonna set the rake right here. You've seen us do that before. Oh, there's a set of forks. There's a rake right there. So I need to go grab that loader and grab those rakes get it on there you grab the keys i hear you say it but when i set it on there pop keep a close eye on that battery box i'll we'll set it up here <clears throat> basically if i remember correctly like a four a fork will sit on each or uh, we'll see on each side of that box okay Grab it. Got to wait on it to quit rocking where we can set it down, not tear anything up. Good, real good. We're good. Right over the battery. What I gotta do when I tighten this one, it will pull that, it will pull it into the battery box. But I gotta give it just a little bit and then start on this other one. And where's the dad gum bind? Oh. What's that, buddy? Doing all right? said we were going to do to the truck today because it was going to be a short day that all just changed we got minimum one more and he said be on standby for a fourth so that's a good thing good problems to have for sure well, they ain't even problems good thing good thing good thing good thing we'll uh we'll wash trucks and fix cbs some other day well, we're gonna get her off of here. Got a phone call earlier from my buddy Bruce. Might have working on bidding two loads into Georgia. That'll be good. What, brother? What? <laughs> Patna man. Good buddy, you. All right, we got it all unchained. My buddy Jeremy's gonna get it off of there. Hey, you know how to run this one, right? Nope. This is first time. This is open cab. <laughs> no, no pushes, no buttons for brakes. Nope. <laughs> Turn the AC on. Yeah. <laughs> this is one of our spare chains. It doesn't belong full-time on the truck that's a uh, 5,000 pound chain 
That's why we don't carry it full time. this before. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go get a dozer. I got, I got pops going to ice find me some, some vehicles behind. It's close. We got this up here. I had to jump some curbs behind me. Tell me if I'm good. I think I'm, I think I'm good. I'll be close. Yeah. You hear me holler. Stop. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Stay to the left. Keep going. Keep going. Go ahead and stop. doing is pulling ahead detaching and she's spinning huh. hopefully our reconnect goes good and we can pull out of here because uh whew, if not it's gonna be tough Drop over the hump. There he goes. Yep, there it is. Chris. Damn, that wood's done. <laughs> ah. Well, we didn't tear it up too bad with the dozer. I tried to get a slow angle. All right, let's pull two off of here and we'll one on the front. Let's try that, see what happens. Trying to pick it up by the huh? We're trying to pick it up by the hoops and back onto the asphalt. We can hook the airlines up and push it onto the asphalt. But right now we can't even get underneath the hoops. So on the good side did it hook or not no i, I had to pull the pin up or we wouldn't break it off go back up all right yeah we're digging ourselves in a bad situation fast
Porter John on the other side. About to take the Porter John out. At least we're getting there. Let's see if we can move this Porter John. Yeah. We're hitting it. <laughs> I'm in the Porter John, Pop. Oh. Somebody's in there too. Hey! Hey, <laughs> right. Uh. What if somebody was in there? That'd be a hell of a ride. What's happening? Snatched off another. God dang mud flap. This one, that's number two, sort of number three since we've got that rake. And then we've got, uh, we've got uh, a roller to do after this. Then we have a traco and a, and a loader for Friday. What up, Tommy? What, did, did he come all the way over here and show you how to unlock the door? The back? No. <laughs> He said the door wouldn't open. Oh, he was the back door. Oh, oh the back door. I got you. I got on it before I got on it. I went to check the oil and the water. And yeah. I couldn't get the door. Hey, at least you're checking oil and water. That's... I told him. I said, who's been checking the damn thing? Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. I can't get the door. Though. Exactly. Somebody backed into something. There's a bit, a dent on the back right here. Not me, not me. Oh, I know you did. Right here. Oh. And it's right at the hinge. Yeah. And we're having to pry the door. But I told him once he got it, we got finally got it open, and so we moved the little rod that the clasp goes on. Yeah. I told him to move it up a little bit, so yeah. he did, and now it shuts and opens and shuts. But what? somebody run into something and bent it, warped the door. Yeah, that happens. But you ought to see all my stuff, but you my can't guys. See backing up with these <laughs> things half the time. We can try. We'll let him get turned first. We're gonna try to take this thing off. Not try. We're gonna take this thing off the side. You got my keys? Yeah, you want your keys? Just so we don't forget them? Yep. Sorry, Pop. I was a little, uh, a little aggressive on that. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Tommy. Yeah. The big man of the hour. <laughs> hey. Hey. <laughs> He's trying to take it easy on my trailer. Pull ahead, Tommy. There you go. good on the wood but not much you can do about it sometimes
Come on back, Tommy. All right, blade, pressure, stop, lift it up. You're good. There you go, baby. Piece of cake. <laughs> Another day, another dollar. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Hell yeah. Right there. We got her done, son. Hey. Well, we're back here at this job. This place is jammed up freaking tight. Goodness gracious. I don't know if you can see my mirror there. jump those curbs behind me in that car wash just to make it to here this guy's trying to get his stuff out of the way for me says this is his roller. Get out of the way. How's that song go? Move! Get out of the way! Steer it this way, Pop. God, don't go forward. They got pushed till Friday. As of now, we have nothing for tomorrow. So, that normally changes, which is fine. But, if it remains that way, tomorrow, truck, trailer, it's all getting clean. 
I got another mud flap to fix. God dog it. This trailer is totally filthy. We'll get all these boxes emptied, wash all the dirt off of them, hit all this oil and crap with degreaser, get all this grease clumps wiped up. Get all this hydraulic oil and stuff cleaned up. This was from that disabled loader. Get all this gone. Reorganized. Well, gone. Clean all the chains. You can see there's just clumps of grease everywhere. There's that freaking grease smeared all over this thing. That's if we have no calls. We'll get that done. And I'm going to reattach to it. I'm going to go to the TA. See my buddy Raccoon, the CB guy. Get my CB done. Then run down to the streaking beacon. Let them finish it off. And, uh, and that would be that. That's a full day in itself. So, but we'll see. We might get some phone calls and have work to do. Look at this guy. He's a roller operator. Operating a little too close to my truck. Smoothing it out. God dog, he about threw himself off of it. <laughs> He's having fun. Let's go look at something. Oh man, I thought I felt it go all the way on there. I was gonna brag on myself. Dang it. Can't do that now. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there she is parked. So far, we don't have any calls for tomorrow and it's late in the evening. We'll more than likely get some calls tomorrow, but we're gonna try to get here early. See if we can pull these signs off. It needs, it's dusty on the inside already. We've been wiping on it, but it needs more than that. See if we can't get her cleaned up. We're gonna try to get all this stuff undone. As far as, uh, we need new boards. Chains are greasy. Boxes are full of dirt. We really need to paint again. That's coming soon. But, uh, if we have time, hopefully, we'll be able to get all that done here and then run down to the truck wash, let those guys do it to it. And there's another tomorrow project. I have been hell on mud flaps lately. <laughs> oh, well. Anyway, I guess if you ain't ripping off mud flaps, you're not off-roading i don't know <laughs> we appreciate y'all hanging out we're gonna head on to the house and we will see you tomorrow